welcome back to another video with Indigo Math. Today, we'll explore the properties of a trapezium. Let's start! The figure below is made of a trapezium, ABCF, and a triangle BGH. Now, if it's a trapezium, we know that the opposite sides, the top and the bottom, they are parallel to each other. So, if they're parallel, it means we can use some sort of angle property. Remember this thing called interior angles? So if I've got something like that, where two lines are parallel to each other, then let's call this angle A and this angle here B. Your angle at A plus your angle at B will add up to give you 180 degrees. And this is interior angles. So let's mark out the parallel sides here in this question first. They said this is the trapezium ABCF. I'm going to highlight it in red. So AB. CF, which means these two lines are parallel to each other. So, hmm, can we identify interior angles? So, do you see the angle here plus the angle at this portion here would add up to give us 180 degrees. And let's see what other information we can make use of in this question. I meant to find angle ABE, which is this angle here that I've already shaded in blue. And you see, you've got 128 degrees there, right? There's this other property. Remember your X-shaped one. This is called vertically opposite angles. If I have two angles that are vertically opposite each other, take note, these lines must firstly be straight lines. Then I can say that the two angles are equal to each other. And this is the angle property, vertically opposite angles. So do you see how we can apply this in this question? If I have angle HED to be 128 degrees, that means angle FEB would also be 128 degrees based on vertically opposite angles. So let me just write it down here first. This is also 128 degrees. That means the angle that we want to find here Angle A, B, E. Remember, these two angles add up to give you 180 degrees because of interior angles since those two lines are parallel. So angle A, B, E would just be 180 degrees minus 128 degrees and that's going to give us 52 degrees based on interior angles. Math really isn't just about practicing questions. Come join us for some fun events. We will show you how math is actually very, very chill. See you soon!